I'm with Steve Webb, and Steve, welcome to Stabler Speed. You're Elfin 360. What's the history on it? What can you tell us about it? Well, it was built in uh, 1969 by the late Gary Cooper down in Edwardstown, South Australia. Uh, there were two Elfin 360s with Rep Repco Brabham's built at the time. Uh, this car was owned initially by Henry Michel and went on to win the Australian Sports Car Championship and was sold a second time into Victoria where it won the Rose City 1000 at Winton, which was the big sports car event at the time. And then I'm only the third owner and I've owned it for 34 years. So uh, I raced it when uh, uh, sports cars were still the done thing, Amaru Park was going, Oran Park was going. And then it sat in my billiard room for a number of years until we uh, had it uh, logbook for historic racing and uh, we get it out on the occasional time now to come and have a bit of fun and brush the cobwebs out of the driver end of the car. <laughs> well, it's got, it's got history, a pedigree, and, and Gary Cooper, what can you say? He was, he was the man at the time, wasn't he? Well, I think certainly it's the case as far as Australian race car builders are concerned, but this, is, this his car is unique in that it has the Repco Brabham engine as well, which is, of course, a derivative of the engine that uh, the famous Jack Brabham used to win his world championships with. So it's quite a, uh, quite a very interesting car and certainly one that uh, brings the spectators along when we get it out. Mm, obviously, you love it, owning it for 34 years. That's a, it's a long time to own a car. Well, it is. I've owned lots of other race cars in the meantime, but this one was always put a, uh, a sparkle in the eye when I drove it, mm. and uh, so it was something that I was never going to sell. So I've been enjoying it ever since. Yeah, well, how'd you go today in practice or race? How'd you go? Well, we just, we just had our first race. Um, it's a matter of, uh, I must confess, I don't come to be competitive any longer. I've been in competitive motorsport for over 40 years, so I just come to enjoy the car and enjoy myself. I started off the back of the grid, and we had a nice joyous drive around with no uh, no eventful uh, time out there at all so yeah it's good to be able to enjoy what you do and no pressure that's great true it uh, i mean my pit crew that come with me now have worked with me since 1969 and every form of motor racing i've been on they've been involved in so we just come out here for, for pleasant weekends good on you thank you so much for your time beautiful car and a credit to steve to own it all that time and still be competitive in it thank you steve thank you.